Hey guys, so I'm pretty sure I've been scammed. <laughs> Let me tell you what's going on. So a few months ago, I saw this ad on Facebook and I was seeing it quite frequently. I don't know if you guys have seen it at all, but it was for a custom blinds doll who looked like Wednesday Adams. I think the selling price was like 55 USD plus shipping. It ended up being about 70 Australian dollars. Yeah, so already that's a red flag because who sells a custom doll that cheap? <laughs> But another red flag was that they had multiple, like hundreds of units of this one of a kind custom doll. <laughs> so, yeah, I went into this knowing that it was a scam, but I bought it anyway. <laughs> I thought it'd be a cool video, and I just want to see what you get. Like, what are they giving people? My guess is that it's going to be a fake girl with black hair, because, you know, Wednesday Adams. But, you know, we're going to find out. So let's just open her. I pay through PayPal and obviously I'm doing this video so I should get my money back if it's not the custom doll. Also the ads haven't been around for like the last month and the shop doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> so that's not a good sign either. But let's open her up. I did find the creator of the original doll that they were using in the images. So I'll link that down below. So let's just see what I got. Before I take it out, like, you guys can hear, or maybe you can't, but you can now. It sounds like a box, like something a Barbie or Brad Store comes in, so I don't know what I'm getting, but... <laughs> oh, please. Oh, it's, it's a black box. I have no idea what it's going to be. I'm sticking with my fake doll. Oh, it smells really fragrant. It smells like perfume. Strongly. Okay, it's in this black box. Oh. <gasps> no! <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, wait. <laughs> I thought it was a shoe box, but it's not. Oh my gosh. Can you see that? This poor girl's like rattling around. I'm gonna take that off. <gasps> oh no. Okay, she's kind of cute anyway, but. Oh, I just realized, sorry, I turned off my autofocus because it was really noisy. It's an icy doll. Oh my gosh. She's not even, she doesn't even have black hair. <laughs> I think that's what I'm most disappointed about. Like, they didn't even try. Like, I gave them credit. <laughs> I thought they would try and give me, like, a black haired doll. They were selling Wednesday Adams. And they gave me Goth Barbie. What the heck? Oh my gosh. She's not even. <laughs> okay, she's not that goth, but she's so cute. And she's so blonde! There's nothing like Wednesday Adams and nothing like the custom doll they were selling. Okay, let's get her out of this box. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I got interrupted. But yeah, look, can you see the little. Oh, you can't, but she's got little black fluffs going on. She's cute, but. This is not what I wanted. This is not what I paid for. Oh my gosh. She's not even secure in her box. <laughs> she just came straight out. Was her box? I think her box got a little bit damaged. She came with little boots, her stand. Um, you know, she's not even alive. She's an IC. And yeah, they're similar, but it's not even the same thing. Like, come on. <laughs> they sent me a blackhead fake Blythe. I'd be like, oh, yeah. Okay. That's funny. But this is just, like, ridiculous. Ugh. She's not having a good hair day. Is that pull tag? Oh, I'm sorry, guys. If you see my ratty nails. They've been absolutely ruined at work. Let me try and focus in on her. So, this is what you will receive. A blonde icy doll. This is on a standard body, not the joint one. Oh my gosh. This doll is like $25 on AliExpress, I'm sure. And I paid 55 USD for it. <laughs> Why? Why did I do this? Oh my gosh. Okay, let's just see what eyes. 
eye chips she has. If I can get her tag out. She has cute brown eye chips. Oh, that was a struggle. Green. Pink. And purple. <sighs> this is funny. Well, yeah, kind of. <laughs> I've been laughing like the whole time. Oh my gosh. I hope none of you guys bought into this. I'm sure you haven't because I'm sure you guys are smart. <laughs> but I just played myself, didn't I? Like I said, I pay through PayPal. I've got all my receipts, so I should be getting my money back. <laughs> wow. What an adventure. The little fluffs are kind of coming off, so I think it's just residue from her clothes and not mold, but the poor thing. Just got this random little outfit with a QR code. I wonder what happens if I scan this. <laughs> Maybe we'll find it later. Oh. Separate so it's a t shirt and this little black skirt. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> um so that's that. I'll just put her shirt back on so she has some modesty. I just don't understand like when you're giving people something so far off what you're trying to sell, what do you expect? <laughs> like honestly, if they were selling if they were giving people <laughs> A black head fake blithe. At least you could kind of get away with it. But this is way off. Like, would it? Like, <laughs> I'm baffled. Oh. Okay, sorry. My camera's obviously sick of me screaming and it decided to stop filming me. <laughs> but here we are again. Um, here she is again. Put her little booties on. They're really cute. She's actually really sweet, but you know, she's not the custom one of a kind Wednesday Adams Blythe doll that I ordered. <laughs> I was curious about this little logo that's on her shirt and on her box. So I did scan the QR code on the back of her t-shirt. It didn't work on my normal QR scanner. So I went through WeChat because, you know, she's from China, so surely WeChat will work. And it did. So we got this page. The company is called Guiding Beauty or Beauty Guide. I had to translate all this, by the way, because I can't <laughs> read Chinese. But it's pretty much like a managerial company in the beauty industry. So if you're an influencer or, I don't know, like a beauty shop or something. But yeah, that's that. Um, it kind of explains her outfit. You know when you go to the beauty counter and all the makeup artists are wearing like this little black outfit and sort of thing. <laughs> Yeah, okay, I'm going to stop talking. This is not what I ordered, but this is what I got. <sighs> Take this as a lesson, guys. Always pay through PayPal. <laughs> Always make sure you're covered and you're safe because you never know what you're going to get. And <laughs> you're not Wednesday Adams. What the heck? Who are you? <laughs>